what drives us to create film, I think, is that we are pathological weirdos and we couldn't stop creating things if we tried. We were meant to. What a great title. What were we meant to do? Tell me all about it. We meant to fly. <laughs> With 6,000 submissions, 415 is hard to make it. So if you're just a part of that alumni class of this year, you're doing pretty good. I think storytelling is important to human beings. We've been doing it since our brains sort of gave us consciousness. Yes. How was your Holly Shorts Film Festival experience throughout the whole run this year? Oh, it's great. We've screened at many festivals across the, the country, but we shot the film here in LA, so to bring it back home and to screen it here in front of the audience here in LA, it's, it's great. It's a great, great, great way to show the film. So it's a love story towards Cicely, towards my mom. It's a love letter towards both. And short love letter, 10 minutes, in and out. I'm in two films tonight. One is called Shadow Brother Sunday, which is Alden Ehrenreich directing. And uh, the other is Swipe NYC, Sue Kramer. And it's a comedy about online dating. I'm a writer on this short, uh, Stefania's short. And um, I think shorts are a lovely way to kind of show a concept and get your story out there. Uh, we were meant to use a coming of age story set in a world where black men have wings and their first flight to rites of passage. We are joined here with Dave Liu, who has his film tonight. Every day after. Every day after. Yeah. To champion independent filmmaking, especially in a time of strike for the writers and uh, the actors, uh, to say that uh, you know you can take a story being self-financed uh, to shoot it, direct it, uh, edit it, and uh, produce it. It's uh, you know, it's it's a it's a work of love. This is a big moment for me. Um, just like first moving to LA, obviously, look, when you are tourists, you walk past the Chinese theater all the time. So to be able to be in a film here is a blessing. It's the story of a young boy, a young Filipino boy, who's born with a facial difference, uh, which is a cleft lip and palate. Holy short film festival, the festival in which you know I've been coming here from the very beginning. Nineteen yeah. years. Yeah, nineteen years. Yeah. My hope is that our film will help change the narrative around people with facial differences, particularly in this environment where we seem to be overjudged by the way we look. My name is Milana Vintrev, and this is Marina Schifrin, who is the writer of Pickled Herring, and I am the director, actor in Pickled Herring. Uh, I think for me, uh, the Holly Shorts uh, Festival is like a full circle moment. I played it a few times, but I think it was always like great audience, uh, participation with questions, um, and just, you know, it's a Chinese theater, so it's kind of, you know, it's, it's a, the screen's always the biggest you screen that, um, and like the turnout is always amazing, so that's probably the biggest thing for it. Really, the motivation is, is to connect with the new filmmakers, because that's really a place where you have time to, to meet them and to speak to them, because within eight minutes or 15 minutes of a short, you can see what kind of vision those people are, have. My name is Clayton Cardenas. I, I play one of the uh, title actors in the film, written by this beautiful man, Bobby Soto. He wrote the film. He is the lead actor in the film. He helped produce the film. So this is the man you really need to lean into. I join here with Mark from Humo, which means smoke in Spanish. It's based on a, uh, a Spanish book about the Holocaust, so heavy stuff. But uh, yeah, I think it's a beautiful story, and it kind of uh, isn't trying to teach any messages, just having us like reflect on the human human condition. Well, the film conference was a tremendous success. The film summit. I mean, this was one of the first years where the filmmakers were like. The panels were insanely good. Not only are you getting the top films from all over the world, um, short films and the next generation of storytellers, but you are also introducing them to the best executives in the business. So it's like a perfect marriage to just continue their careers and hopefully build the next Tarantino's and Spike Lee's. We are in a impractical, illogical business that we will not quit. So Holly Shorts will return to the 20th edition, 20th anniversary of the Holly Shorts Film Festival, August 8th through 17th, 2024.